Here is some good news for consumers. Our call for action office has been hard at work at getting some good results. Yes, yeah, so Karen Stiles from our call for action office joining us today to give us some more information on just what kind of cases you have been working on in 2020. We've had some very interesting cases lately, a lot of problems with uh, billing, uh, phone problem, phone companies, mm -hmm. medical billing, as well as debt collectors that won't correct some of the problems. But we've also had a lot of calls that have come in regarding um, insurance claims, uh, as well as you always get the contractors who won't finish sure. the job. Right. But what we're doing to get success is that when you contact Call for Action, we reach out to you, we mediate between you and the business or the agency involved. Mm -hmm. Our volunteers are really good at cutting through some of the red tape, getting sure. to the right people who can help. And when we can't resolve a problem, giving you some really good resources on where you can turn next to take additional action. Would you say that that's where your success lies? Absolutely. And in fact, um, some of our successes lately have been um, consumer, uh, one consumer in particular that had, was being overcharged. We got over $4,000 oh, back for her. Wow. Um, but sometimes the cases don't always involve money. Sometimes it's just a matter of you know, getting a business or an agency to communicate with people and doing the right thing to get things resolved. Communi hmm. Communication is key and just finding the right resource is also key. So let's put up that number because you're going to be there, right? Absolutely. We're staff. opening our our call for action lines right now. Okay, so let's so get that number up there. You. It is 414-967-5495. So you'll get somebody there that will answer that call and uh, get some answers if you have some questions. It's a tax season time too. I imagine you Absolutely. get questions around tax season. Or you've ordered things, they haven't come in. And if you get our voicemail, leave a message. We will definitely call you back. Just depends on how many calls come in right now. All right.